channel. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I decided to go to AMEC. <laughs> Very last minute. This last minute thing is not for me. I ended up missing the flight. We're just chilling. You know, <laughs> you know the vibes. <laughs> Hey guys, that's loud. Last I spoke to you guys, um, or the last vlog that I did was me at Medball. And <laughs> I thought I was not gonna be vlogging in a very long time. I genuinely thought that the next time that I would vlog, you know, probably be two weeks from now because I'm not really doing anything school-wise. I spoke too soon because I decided to go to AMEC. <laughs> very last minute um i will be going to amec for the amec conference um for those who don't know what amec is it's a conference done yearly by snme snme student national medical association it's an organization for minority medical students so the conference is happening in orlando florida <laughs> the way this was last minute i can't even believe how this shit worked out. Okay, guys, I just got my hair cut. <laughs> but anyway, as I was saying, very much last minute. Like, at the time I went to Med Ball, I didn't, this was not even a thing in the works. Like, I wasn't thinking of doing this. We got our tickets like yesterday for a really good price. And it's so crazy to me how everything worked out because the way, the way the flight tickets were not that expensive, like flying from here to Florida, as of a couple days ago, actually, the flight ticket was showing like $500 and so I'm like, there's no way, there's absolutely no way that I'll be able to do this. And then we're able to cut down by like more than two thirds that amount. So it's literally ridiculous. So shout out to Adrian, shout out to you girl, because whatever you did, sis, this is the first in-person conference that is happening or that yeah that's happening since i started medical school the last in-person conference was the su summer i think ish before medical school started for me so that was in 2019 uh, moving forward it's all been like virtual and stuff but this is the first in-person conference happening in a long time i'm like this is a great time for me to go you know meet people make connections you know like this is a great opportunity for me i'm leaving tomorrow morning and we got our tickets yesterday so yesterday like afternoon ish so from yesterday down i've had to like start picking up stuff going to find business casual clothes like <laughs> i don't really have things so i'm like oh my god i have to pack i just got my hair cut this morning it's like 11 26 all morning i've been trying to like figure out like formal clothes or business casual clothes that i could wear and thank the lord that i was able to find some in my closet the conference is wednesday through friday there's also something happening on saturday so wednesday through saturday so i'm trying to pack like wednesday thursday friday saturday like four you know business casual clothes so i'm lucky that i actually found up to four in my closet this is in orlando florida it's gonna be warm i have to pop, pack some warm clothes you know it's a c it's a c it's a c so it's just a whole bunch of stuff and i have to get it all done today because we're leaving tomorrow early early in the morning um like 5 30 is the flight so yeah it's, it's a packed day for me but anyway i wasn't going to vlog this but i'm like you know what it's a medical thing <laughs> because i have so many vlogs that i haven't put out yet and not just like vlogs like other videos on like applications things like that that i'm trying to i try my best to make sure it coincides with when people will need this information but yo by the time i finish editing time don't pass you know time has passed so it's just editing is a whole thing anyway i'm gonna stop talking right now and um i think this is gonna be a fun fun vlog you guys so definitely stick around because i'm back home and i am just trying to pick outfits and stuff everything's so last minute i don't have money so any fit that i find in my closet right now is a go whether or not i've worn it 15 times i'm just going to have to manage with it this way but you guys look at this <laughs> I just picked up my contacts you guys i always have glasses on always 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 oh i tried out contacts um a couple weeks ago but the contact solution i didn't have contact solution so they dried out at the next day um so that's why i'm picking up these ones today has been such a day like i've been packing since last time i spoke to you guys i've just been trying to pick, put things together like man this last minute thing is not for me yes it's been last minute but everything has been working out from the flights to like even picking up these contacts because i was so scared they'd be like oh you know come pick them tomorrow but today that was quick that was actually really quick all right guys i'm done chatting let's head out guys 
<laughs> so I didn't get to vlog this when it happened because I was upset and um, I actually almost cried. But you know how I said the flight was supposed to be at 5.30 a.m.? Um, so I ended up missing the flight. So like I got home, you know, spent the rest of the day getting my stuff together. I was actually already sort of done packing. I just had like last minute things to do. And I was tired after a long day and other things that happened midway. I was tired and I was like, you know what, let me just sleep for like 10 to 20 minutes. Nothing crazy. Ask me why I wake up to calls from my friends like, where are you? Have you left the house? You need to leave. Da -da -da -da. I had a couple missed calls. And I checked the time and the 20 minutes turned to two hours. Like, I was like, what happened? And I had to be like, oh, I'm on my way, I'm on my way type thing. So they don't know that I just woke up. I was like, so embarrassed. And then the Uber wasn't showing to take me to the airport. So I had to drive. It was just a whole thing. By the time I got to the airport, it was one hour before boarding. And the flight that I took was Frontier. And my first time flying Frontier. So I wasn't expecting the line that I saw when I got there. Like, the line was curved, you guys. And by the time I got there, my friends were already, like, past TSA. They were already, like, at, their, at the gates and stuff. And, um, yeah, I just did not make it. And I just felt very bad because my friends refused to leave without me. So we were all, I basically made all of us miss the flight. While they were, like, at the gate and stuff, and I was downstairs still trying to get my stuff together, they ended up, like figuring out like a new flight for us like the next available flight which was a whole hassle because flights were booked but anyway it's just long story shot i missed the flight but thanks to my travel partners and these humans because they figured out like another flight we didn't have to pay for anything it was like oh cool it ended up working out but at the time you guys i was stressed <laughs> So it's day one of the conference. I haven't had time to update you guys on everything going on because it's been a rough couple of days and a rough couple of hours since we landed but conference will be starting <laughs> conference is starting oh okay oh all right guys i can't even vlog Ugh. i was vlogging yeah is this very good i don't know i think you go down for registration no yeah what's that one? Oh, I thought i thought i saw everybody coming out this way I think they were coming down from their rooms down there. They're all going down over there. Wait, wait. Okay, where are we going? We don't know oh, where we're going. Are my, my Grace is stressing me out. Adrian is over there trying to figure out something. Her usual. Okay. Here you go. Go say hello. You want the bag. Adrian. <laughs> One thing about Adrian, she's going to bring my bag. I'm going to bring my bag. Hey, girl. Welcome to my YouTube channel. <laughs> Future doctors, you know. I'm sweating. Oh, you can smell it. Yeah. Oh, that's nice lighting. I that's what I'm you. saying. You know, but we're about to go to another session. Actually, we haven't been looking to see where we're going. That's true. Oh, no, no, my sister called me right now. So guys, I'm Oni's friend who likes to eat and Oni don't like to eat. Okay, so, okay, been, first of all. We've been walking for 17 hours. We've only, <laughs> first, we've only had two pieces of bagel. And we <laughs> two pieces. And we split it. <laughs> she said we split the orange. What part did we split the orange? We split the orange. I can't. First of, first of all, Adrian, Adrian had her breakfast this morning. 
I'm not sure why she's she's so hungry because are you hungry, guys? I am. Well, oh wow! Guys, so I guys, guess it's just me then. Just, just let me know if you eat breakfast at 8 a.m. <laughs> and it's 4 p.m. If that's if that's just a hard question to ask. Okay, me. fine. Let's go eat. We're about to eat at. Y'all heard that because now she's going to say it's me. <laughs> I'm still vlog vlogging every day. Hey y'all, welcome back to our YouTube channel. So I'm Adrian, and I'm gonna be over here vlog. We a little late right now, so the conference got. Um, all right, so hi guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. I'm a little late right now, and I broke two nails. No, two nails. Right, two nails. But, but the night's still young. It's only six o'clock, so stay tuned. My watch is dead as well. It's gonna rub dead. Her phone's dead. Her watch is dead. Uh, we're done for the day though. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Speaking about that for an Amex. <laughs> We've made a lot of connections. We, make a lot of we got a lot of okay, goodies. Lot of stuff. Okay, baby, baby. Uber is south. Uber is south. But the Uber is here, so we're gonna Uber's get back in. to y'all every next week. Yeah. Oh thanks guys. I appreciate it. Appreciate the love. Okay. <laughs> It's day two of AMEC. I haven't been vlogging as much and uh, my apologies. But yesterday was a great day. We got done at like, what time did we get done yesterday? Five ish? Yeah. Okay. We got done at five and then went home. Actually, we ate a little bit and I think I vlogged a little bit of that. And then we went to the night event, which was fun. But we didn't go to bed until like 3, 4 a.m. Yes, and now it's 9 a.m. and we're here bright and early for the next day. So there's, an, there's a couple like really nice events or good events that I would like to attend today. Um, I'm already running late for the first one, but well. Anyway, I'm hoping to meet some people today, you know, do more chatting. Hope it's a great day. Yeah, I'll try to vlog more. We'll divide the things you need to do for you into chocolate digestible chunks of knowledge that you can look at every day over a 30 day span. But you gotta commit to it, okay? Like trust in the process, trust in the calendar. Okay. You good, sis? No. At this time, I would like to ask any of the 67 current global health fellows to stand to be recognized and congratulated. I don't know who she's talking about. I'm sorry, man. Right now. <laughs> <laughs> I misplaced my right contact and then decided that it was wise to only wear one so I have the left contact one and the right one isn't there but I can't see I can actually write I can see on this eye if I close this it's clear but this is really conflicting that so it doesn't feel good then I also wear my glasses but when I wear the glasses it counter correct the left sorry <laughs> okay I took off the contacts now so I'm going to put my glasses on peacefully while Grace is still down there fixing. I don't know what she did with her shoes. She's out here stressing me out. She's been doing, been doing the same thing for the last couple seconds. Anyway. Alright, so I'm going to be the ugly one. Not ugly, I guess. I don't want to say ugly, but I'm going without. I'm going with them. I'm going with them. I'm going, I'm going with my glasses. Good to go. Thank you. 
Okay, so here we are. <laughs> Conference vibes. <laughs> Conference vibes. Behind the scenes. Behind the scenes of Adrian's uh, get ready process. We got here a little late. Which but we're not done yet. So Y'all see what Which we have to this? go through? Which one is this? Oh, um. This one? Uh, what, uh, is this two? Sorry. That's the bigger one, put yeah. it in the middle. Okay, right. and. There is me, just uh, waiting. I'm ready. So we're in the bathroom, as you all can see. It's really cute. And everything honestly has been going on in this resort. I don't think I've talked much about the resort that we have our conference at. Stalls over there, so never mind. But. But we've been having events at the at the Rose and Shingle Resort resort all week. Today's Saturday. I don't even think I've spoken to you guys, but today's Saturday, and um, we're done with everything for like all the events of AMEC. We're kind of done like with the serious business stuff. So tonight is kind of last night, Saturday night, and people start leaving by tomorrow, which is Sunday. Um, we're actually out by tomorrow, 2 p.m. So we have this really cool gala night type of thing. Um, and then tonight there's something else going on which we're probably gonna go for and then we have to pack and leave tomorrow morning and get back to school so. and they're still there trying to get ready but yeah um, that's all I have to say to y'all I'll see you guys in the event I might vlog a little bit but we'll see Class of 2022, you guys, graduating class, everyone who's matched, so lit. You guys, we stepped up for a sec to go get pictures, and it didn't serve us our food. So we haven't eaten at dinner, and I'm upset because my belly needs food. I've had like this is dessert that he gave to us, so we had that and we had salad for appetizer. But like, where's the meal? Look great. Alright, All right, guys, so we're kind of done with the banquets ish. We stepped out. We're waiting for Adrian. I don't know where she went, but <sighs> we're just chilling. You know, <laughs> you know the vibes. <laughs> oh, these beautiful black doctors, man. I don't think I've ever been to a place with so many black people <laughs> at once. I honestly do not think so. That's not in Nigeria. <laughs> like, this is the first time. I'm so sorry if I'm chewing and you're, oh, y'all are hearing that. I actually apologize, but this is the first time that I've been around so many black people and all of them are doctors. Like, look at your future doctors. Damn, and this is not even everyone. There's still a lot of people in the halls and stuff, but look at everyone looking cute. Okay, girl. Okay, sis, you better wrap that. There was no consent taken before taking that video. I hope she forgive me, miss. Everyone looks cute, y'all. It's all dressed up and stuff. So. I look good. I love how I look. Too. 
yeah. Grace isn't trying to take any big videos or anything. She's just chilling. She's like, whatever, she's done. You guys, stupid me dropped my glasses. So now, ah, I'm out here searching for them. I swear I left them here. Oh, okay, there they are. Yay. Oh, I was scared that I was not going to find them. Found them. Let's go. I think that's the car. <laughs> Jesus. There's a second event tonight. I don't know if I'll be able to vlog much, much of it, but there's another event tonight. Not an event, just a club. And then we leave tomorrow. I'm tired. Play to wow, they really oh, left me. Why all this phone is good? I don't know. Thank you. Thank you. Guess who's gone? And that y'all all in my picture. That's a new distress kind of dream. Let's go. Not y'all in my picture. Move. <laughs> guys so today is <coughs> today's monday <laughs> i haven't spoken to you guys since the flight yesterday um we got back in the evening and i think i got home around like, like 7 p.m and i was so tired to even say anything amac 2022 was a very good experience in general i think for me in terms of like meeting people fourth year is coming very soon you know the board step two is coming soon um, it were rotation planning, all of that stuff. Yeah, AMEC was great. It was a very great, like, experience for me to have. So right now I have, like, a whole lot of, like, emails to send and, like, people to reach out to and things to plan. Um, I get overwhelmed just thinking about it, which is why I haven't done anything today because I'm like, where do I, where do I start? Where do I even start? And I'm tired because, again, last week was very hectic in terms of activities. Like, it was packed to the brim. But um, I wanted to come on here, you know, just to let you guys kind of fill you guys in, you know, I'm back, we got home safe. Uh, I feel like there's a couple of things that I didn't get to say, but I'm just going to say AMEC 2022 was a lot of fun. There were like 3,000 people who attended, so like that's a lot. And the fact that all these people are just future and current black doctors is ridiculous. And I know people who didn't go. So, you know, there's still a lot of people, like a lot of my friends actually didn't go, so... Yeah, it's crazy. It's just honestly so crazy. And I'm definitely going to be there next year. The connections were amazing. Like, so we had, a, they had a resort reserved. Um, and so a lot of people stayed in that resort. All the events happened in the resort. Unfortunately, like I said, it was very last minute planned. Again, we didn't even think we we're going until the Monday before when it was supposed to start on Wednesday. So we didn't get a hotel in the resort because it was expensive at the time. Could have saved us a lot of time. Would have had more time to interact and socialize with people. But we didn't stay in the resorts. We stayed in a different hotel, which was like eight minutes drive away. Yeah, but just to say that even though we were kind of away and we're not able to attend everything, it was still such a great experience. Like, this was a very nice um, couple of days. And it was like, what, Wednesday to Sunday is a long time. Anyway, um... <laughs> It was a lot of fun, you guys, and honestly wish that I like, started planning like a long time ago, but for the fact that it wasn't even something that I was considering doing, and I was still able to go, and I'm back, and I'm not fully broke, even though I am broke. I am so grateful for all the connections and everything that I gained from that experience, and it's something that I would definitely 100% advise if you're a pre-med, you know, international student or not for people for national people who follow me you know your medicine whatever it is as long as you're in the medical space <clears throat> you're black or you're um, pro diversity in the medical field you should this is something that's definitely for you um i'm pretty sure most schools have an snma chapter in their school so you would definitely hear about emec from those um from your club and stuff so this is 100 something to attend it's definitely worth it 
and if anything if i didn't get anything just being in space with so many other black doctors is like just empowering on its own because again being in medicine like most of the time you're probably the only black face right or one of the few it's like 10 10 percent of your class are black you know most of the time so you don't get to see as many black faces in most of these spaces being black and being a minority in this environment especially my environment of medicine really brings people together and you just get so much support like you have people rooting for you people you've never met before rooting for you it was such a great time Oosh. i'm like talk talk the whole time i forget that i have a meeting oh you guys my psych grades came out i don't know if you watched my last vlog you guys but this is the one that i talked about going through a lot during that exam i'm actually really scared okay i'm gonna open it since you guys are here. please let me just pass <gasps> <laughs> wow 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 are you kidding me wow you guys this has been my highest score <laughs> highest comat score i haven't seen this score ever i told you guys go watch my other video if you haven't seen the, if you didn't if you didn't watch if you didn't watch my last vlog on psych please go watch it because you guys i was stressed like they took they did a lot to me during this exam oh for the fact that that happened and i actually did really well is crazy to me i feel like when you feel your worst you do your best like i hate that because that's actually my high score so oh this week has been so good to me you guys this has been such a good week this has been such a good week to me you guys honestly i could cry wow i'm just like happy <laughs> When everything's are being too good, I start getting stressed. Okay, well, I'm happy that that went well. I'm done talking because I have a meeting now. It's 3.47. I need to head to my meeting. But thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I have convinced you to come for AMEC. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I definitely had fun. It's probably one of my best vlogs to, um, to film, even though I didn't film everything. Um, I definitely talked about my channel on one of the AMEC um, um, talks that we had. So we had a couple of influencers, your favorite influencers, if you know so say Adida Flygeri, and I'm just calling their handles right now. I'm um, Dr. Tosin. She's, she goes by Life by Tosin on Instagram. Um, and a couple others that I'm not remembering off the top of my head. But, you know, they were just giving advice on, like, certain things. Just being a influencer, doing YouTube, doing Instagram, different things like that. And um, one thing I struggle with is being an introvert. I don't talk about this channel on my personal page i only recently started even sharing pictures on my personal page on this page but i don't talk about this page on my personal page because in my head i'm like well it's my personal page and i don't know if i have many medical people following me on there um and also if i don't have many like this is a medical page you know but moving forward like i've noticed that it's just not medicine i talk about like i definitely do vlogs on my life i do vlogs on being an international student it's kind of like just life here um navigating these spaces so um i'm trying more so now to put out myself out talk more about this channel um on different platforms um and talk to people about it when i meet people um i'm very shy and like very introverted about it and i was okay with that like i genuinely was okay with that because people still found me like all the people following me on here like found me either on instagram or on youtube or about someone talking to someone or someone posting about me on facebook you know people who join me here found me um and i'm very grateful to you guys for coming back and watching um and then i have you of course my med school friends who also found me because i didn't tell them about it <laughs> so yeah it's bad but um i'm going to definitely start putting it out more um i do want people to find me i'm not doing this just for myself i want international students to find me i want them to to watch some of these videos and hopefully find some of them helpful because my mentees tell me that they found these videos helpful so why am i hiding myself why yeah like the video you guys share 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 T to people who you think will benefit from the video subscribe to the channel join the family and i'll see you guys on my next one bye